Now we're going to actually make our warrior. There's me. There's my little character here. And we're going to make a new one. So, should we have... <laughs> should we have a male or a female? Oh. Let's first name them. Um... But we're going to have to consider the fact of whether or not it's going to be a male or female. So give me a fire out a name to anyone. I could flick a coin. If I had a coin, I might have one in my pocket. I do have one in my pocket. I'm calling heads as female, tails as a male, without dropping my controller. It's a head. We've got a female. Right, give me a name. I'm a bitch. <laughs> South Well, I just called him M. Huh? Oh, what's all this? Oh, wow, I can select all of the uh like their history and what like their um uh, I guess their clan and history and, and what their background is. That's really cool. Okay, I'm going to go for Dan Mai. There we go. We've got a name. Ah! Keep pressing... Keep pressing the wrong buttons. And... There we go. Bugger. The buttons, because of the um, the switch around with the X and circle, I keep pressing the wrong bleeding things. There we go. We've got a Damai, and it's going to be female. And so, we need a face. Oh, Chaco. Trust you, hentai. Um, right, so we've got choices of up to 68 hairstyles. And this is what I mean by the loading is pretty, like, there's a lot of loading. Don't notice a lot of difference in some of these, but... I will scroll through until you say... Uh, you got to call out a number. Let me type this. I mean, it's hard to make this with um with such a delay. I'm 
that skips 30. Obviously, I can change the face and the uh, skin color and everything else. 53, 54. They seem to be popular ones. Okay. Just about through the list. Okay, it's 53 and 54. 53. Okay, it's not a lot of difference. I like 54. There we go, I'm going 54. And what colour hair should she have? Again, we've got a massive choice of colours. So just give me a base colour. So if you give me a base colour then we'll work on that white. Okay, well Koitech my Europe want white. That's as white as it goes. Although I think that's quite a nice tint. It's a slight rose. I'm gonna go for that. And what have we got here? Oh, this is her eyebrows. <laughs> there are loads of eyebrows. And this is where we can actually do all the um, editing. So we can like start editing on here, like the forehead and um, how narrow you want the eyebrows and everything else. So there is tons of customization options. Um, I could change her skin colour. Can have a green one. So, by the way, if you have, if you think, uh, if you think of a skin colour we should have, I think with the white hair we can't have too pale. See, that's kind of cool. Oh, this is the face type. Okay, so we're working on face type here. Got three different types. So this is a shorter, shorter, rounder, a pointier, and I think that's kind of just midway. I'm going to give it another one. Um, I can make it really old. <laughs> <laughs> so she's got <laughs> she's got a really uh, vintage complexion. Um, or, or I can make her very uh, very fair skinned. So there's uh, various aging options here. I don't think I want to wager too much. I can have a fat head, a fat round head, or I can have a skinnier head. I think I'll stick to that. Point to your chin. Let's have that. Um, oh, that's the back jawline. Mm. 
that's the very back jawline. You could just about see the movement in there. So you could really define the face as you wish. Um, that's, I think, the palest colour. I think she looks like she's dead. I think that looks horrible. That one's sunburnt. Okay, what are we doing now? Oh, this one's the eyebrows. So we have a choice of 16 eyebrows. Uh, that one is none. That one's just dots. That's a mono brow. Uh, big bushy ones. I think some finer ones. And we probably want. Probably want something to match our hair. Maybe a little darker. That'll do. Right, let's do. Um. Ugh. What the f eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not use those eyes. We've got 54 choices of eyes here. Um, and I can change the colouring of each eye as well. Um, but let's get a base eye set done. Mum's uh, looks like she's been taking something. Japanese. So what kind of eyes do we want? Do we want bigger eyes, smaller eyes, uh, more s slanted eyes? There's just so many options. Again, fire me a number. If you see something that you like, fire me a number. So I'm getting told smaller eyes. Huge. Ooh, I skip one. I think these are all big ones. By smaller, I'm not going to go for that kind of smaller. Well, I can go. I can go into male versions after I've done a female, and I'll just go straight into armor um, and just use the default character. Um, okay, these eyes will do, and let's. We can do single eye colors, and we can do so. You can change the color of one eye to be one thing, and the other eye to be another. Um, but I'm going to give her some kind of more 
actual coloured eyes. But there, there is plenty of choice in here. Okay, that will do. And again, you can, you know, you can fiddle about the eyes as you so wish. Have them bigger, smaller, higher, lower, closer, further apart. More open, more closed. Not sure what that is. Oh, I guess it's the pupil size, bigger or smaller. Right. And this is how, if you look where the uh, where the uh, irises and pupils are see that they are moving. Um, so you can make them look higher, lower. And I guess that's an eyeshadow. So you can mess around with eyeshadows as well. I've made a really ugly character. <laughs> I use a bright colour so you can kind of see the different types of shadows, and that's none. Right, uh, we've got now. Um, I can't work out what's go, what's actually changing. <laughs> this is ridiculous because there's just so this is way too many options. This one's the nose. So again, there's like loads of different options. And if you find something that you you kind of like, but you want it to be edited a little bit, you can always uh, like make things bigger, smaller. Higher, lower, wider, skinnier. Crooked. Pointy. So there's all of that. Um, here we've got different mouths. You can actually give the lipstick to the guys as well if that's what you want. Don't know whether to use something which is more natural or Again, this is this has customization options, so you can um, make a mouth bigger, smaller. Um, longer, shorter, higher, lower, give a smile, make a sad, make her a miserable little so and so. Of 
God, I don't want her to look miserable. <laughs> uh, right. Well, this is a more natural looking lips and... Let's give her a bit of attitude. That'll do. She's not miserable. She's just got a bit of a uh, bit of attitude. There we go. And now for cust um, other customizations. So things like eye patches, um, whatever that is on her head, markings, kitty symbols. Tattoos. Uh, I think the the final options are all like glasses and stuff. And give them moles. So I can make a spark with glasses. I don't want to make. I, I'm not. I'm trying not to make this so boring. It's just, it's really hard to. Um, I quite like these glasses, actually. I think she looks rather cool. But I think once we get the problem is with glasses. Once you get the armor on, it just looks odd. So I'm gonna not use anything. Right. There's our. Um, character. We can now change her build so we can make her uh, skinny, fat, tall, short, however, you know, however we want. Well, she's a warrior, so she needs a bit of bulk. She can't be too petite. Mm, I don't want a big head. A little bit taller. I think that's too stocky. Mm. Yes, yeah, about right for the arms. Nice long legs and. Oh, that's a bus size. I'm sure you guys are all for a bigger bust, right? <clears throat> So yeah, you can um, you can have big or small boobs. That's the bigger, and that's the smaller. So there we go. There's our character. Right now for now for the gear. So here we go. <laughs> now this confused the hell out of me earlier, trying to work out what pieces I was using. But I've got to select each one, so uh, this is a def uh, If I go into this column here, I can suck the whole outfit. And then if I go into here, I can actually just select pieces from an outfit. And then just customize it as I so wish. I think a little crown looks quite nice on her. Um, there are just so many costume options. What's this gloves? And what I did discover earlier was when it comes to weaponry, um, before in Dynasty Warriors 7 Empires you were restricted as to who could use I think things like whips and the, uh, the flute and stuff, where they were restricted to female characters. Now anyone can use any weapon, which is really cool. I'm going to assume that everything here 
is what's going to be included in the game at launch. And then there'll probably be DLC pieces which you can buy um, as additional. And probably bits you can unlock as well. I mean, in all previous other games you've been able to unlock things. I had some bangles a second ago, I don't know... I mean, okay, they're all the way back up there. Oh, they... I like those. They'll do. Um, oh, and I can change the colour as well, so... Um... I don't want boots. No, I don't think boots go with the uh, go with the dress. Shoes like that would be fine. With a little bit of armor on the legs. Oh, and by the way, I can go and change. See, if I go here, I can change the color of the whole outfit. Or I could just go in and select individual pieces. That's Blue shoes, red ones, green ones, blue ones, light blue. Okay, but that's that's her, okay. <laughs> Not sure what I just did there. Okay, so there's um, there's her. Um, now let's go for weapons. What kind of weapon should she use? Well, the um, now Dynasty Warriors. Uh, Seven Empires demo. I don't think it, uh, the Create Warrior demo came this way, so it probably won't come this way either. Um, I really have my fingers crossed that you know we're going to get Empire. Uh, we actually, I think we have had an announcement for Empires here. Um, so anyway, let's go for weapons. What kind of weapons should she have? What kind of warrior is she? I mean, you can go into you can go into here, and you can just um, select uh, select something, and then is it this one? No, here. And when you select it, everything on your list will be um, all the same uh, same weapon. So you get the the sets for that particular weapon type. Okay, so I've got a cross between. Uh, oh, actually, well, as I saw, as that one's above, I will go for. Oh, wrong thing. Um, press the wrong button. Okay, let's. What? Not this one. I 
I think she would look quite cool like that. You know, with a with the Shang her. That would be awesome. Um, but you guys are helping me make it, so I am going for the first op the first one in that list, which is. Oh, I guess this is all way stuff now. The R1 and L1 at the top there, that's for the different uh, factions. So there we go, we've got this set. And we can change the EX attacks. We can change EX1, um, EX2. Or is this Musu? Uh, no, these are the Musu attacks, I believe. Um, these are the EX attack. Um, so we can go for different Musu types. Um, let's see if I can find a bow. So we've got a bow move in here. Uh, one of these is one of these is for the rage, and I think the other I can't remember. You got the aerial musu, and the other one will be um, your rage. Um, I think the bottom one is actually the rage attack. I'm going to pick I'm just going to go for something completely random for this She's going to have They're not Guan Yin pings Oh I like this one Yes Here we go So there's um, There's that And this is her voice Um, and you can do this in list form as well. There's just loads of different options. And you can also then change the pitch. Really high pitch. There we go. I'm gonna have that. And what's this? Oh, this has stats. I, I, because I don't really, I, I mean I can remember most of these um, from the other games but I can't remember, what I don't know what all of them, all of them say. Um, so let's save this. 